Today we're taking a look at the New York Yankees vs. Baltimore Orioles match, which is happening on Wednesday, April 7, 2021 at 6.35 p.m., and giving you my betting tips and predictions in general on this game. Welcome back to High Stakes, let's get straight into it, also. Don't forget to subscribe to get notified as soon as we release these sport prediction videos. Jameson Tyon has watched the New York Yankees pitchers farewell the first time through the rotation on the 2021 season. On Wednesday, Tyon gets his turn. He will make his first start in nearly two years when the Yankees seek their 13th straight home victory over the Baltimore Orioles. The Baltimore Orioles have looked like an inconsistent baseball team in the American League as they have won three of their first five games. However, Baltimore did start the season with a 3-0 record after sweeping Boston on the road to start the season before traveling to New York for this three-game series. Everything quickly went sour for the Orioles as they have lost their first two games of this series by at least five runs and they are now in danger of getting swept with another loss on Wednesday. The main reason for their struggles has been their offense, which has only generated two runs in the last 18 innings. Now, Baltimore will be looking to avoid getting swept. The Baltimore Orioles will look to rebound from a 7-2 loss to the Yankees on Tuesday. Rio Ruiz had a home run and two RBIs that made up all of Baltimore's scoring as a team in the losing effort. Michael Franco went 2 for 4 with a double and Ryan Mountcastle also went 2 for 4 as well while Trey Mancini had a double and Cedric Mullins had a base hit as well to finish off Baltimore's offense in defeat. Dean Kramer took the loss after allowing 3 runs on 5 hits with 5 strikeouts over 3 innings of work. John Means will start here and is 1-0 with a 0.00 ERA and 5 strikeouts this season. In his career means is 1-2 with a.7.17 ERA and 21 strikeouts against the Yankees. The Baltimore Orioles will be going with John Means as the starter for this game which should get fans very excited based on his results up to this point. So far this season, he has looked great as he has a 1-0 record along with a 0.00 ERA. However, he had a 6.48 ERA against the Yankees last season so one can expect a bit of regression on Wednesday. Baltimore's offense is led by outfielder Cedric Mullins who has looked amazing at the plate up to this point as he has a team high .524 BA along with one walk and one stolen base. After a mediocre 2020 campaign, it appears that Mullins might be on the verge of a career year. Cole tossed 7 scoreless frames with 13 strikeouts and no walks, producing arguably the best start of the young 2021 season. Aaron Judge finished 3 for 5 with a home run and 4 RBIs while Jay Bruce also homered for the Yankees in the win. The New York Yankees will look to build on their big win over the Orioles from Tuesday night. Aaron Judge led the way going 3 for 5 with a home run and 4 RBIs while Jay Bruce had a solo home run and John Carlos Stanton went 2 for 4 with a double and an RBI. Brett Gardner and Kyle Higashioka each had a double while Jaya Urshela, Labor Torres and DJ LeMahieu each had a base hit as well in the victory. Garrett Cole got the win after tossing 7 shutout innings, allowing 4 hits while striking out 13 on the way to the win. Jameson Tyon will make his Yankee debut here in what will be his first appearance since May of 2019. This will be Tyon's first career start against Baltimore. New York will turn to right-handed flamethrower Jameson Tyon for his Yankees debut on Wednesday. The former Pirates starter underwent Tommy John surgery in 2019 but looked sharp during the spring, pitching to the tune of a 1.09 ERA with 14 strikeouts in 8 and one-third innings of work. The 29-year-old comes in with a 29-24 overall record with a 3.67 ERA and 1.25 with an 82 career MLB starts but was starting to get a better drip on his arsenal in his third full season as a starter. Prior to getting hurt, Tyon had cut his walk rate to just 1.93 batters per nine innings of work while posting 3.80 FIP in 2019. While this will be Tyon's first career start against the Orioles, there are a couple of Orioles hitters that have seen him before. Current Baltimore batters are hitting just .133 in 17 plate appearances off of Tyon heading into Wednesday's matchup. 
So here are my betting suggestions for that game. The Orioles left-hander allowed 21.8% of his fly balls to leave the yard but posted a lucky .216 Babbitt in 2020 and followed that up with a .059 Babbitt in his first start of 2021. Needless to say, those marks are due for some regression and it wouldn't surprise me if that started here against a team that has had his number in the past. My first betting advice for that game is to pick New York Yankees minus 1.5. Baltimore is now 3-2 on the season after their loss on Tuesday. They had 7 hits in the game but were 0-4 with runners in scoring position and struck out 14 times. Starter Dean Kramer went just 3 innings, allowing 3 runs on 5 hits with 5 strikeouts. To start the year the Orioles have a .254 team batting average with 1 home run and 20 runs scored. Starting for the Orioles will be lefty John Means. He got the win in his first start after tossing seven scoreless innings of one-hit ball with five strikeouts and no walks. He has a lot of experience against the Yankees' current lineup. In those matchups he has allowed a collective .224 batting average with four home runs in 63 at-bats. The Yankees are 6-4 in their last 10 regular season games, and the over is 5-5. Baltimore is 4-6 in their last 10 regular season games, and the over is 6-4. My second betting advice for that game is to pick under 9.5. Good luck to all of you. That's it for this video. Stay tuned and stay safe for the next betting tips and advice.